so you know. Whack 100. Talking that noise again against my fellow Bay Area native, JT the Bigger Figure. <clears throat> Shout out Trap Flix TV. But yeah, you know, like, see, when Whack 100 goes off about anybody else, you know, like in the South, East, you know, even his uh, Southern California peeps, you know, like, I, I get bothered. I get pissed. I'll be like, you got to be kidding me. <clears throat> you know, because no matter who, who he's going against, I always be like, man, Whack 100. Like, now I see why his nickname is Whack, because he's Whack, you know? I mean, you know, he, he asks about everybody. You know, he's a, he's a, I don't know, he's just so damn annoying, man. It's like a, a, a nap, you know, you just want to like, shh. you know, it's like a little, you know, one of those little moths and stuff, man, be flying in your ear. But yeah, you know, game start off with JT, the bigger figure. <clears throat> Well, anyway, let me get back to what I was going to say, actually. So, yeah, when he talks about everybody else from the South, East, whatever, I get bothered and pissed. But when he talks about somebody from the Bay, I really get pissed. Like, JT, the bigger figure is from, you know, San Francisco and all that. Filmo. You know, um, so it's like, I, I, that, that's right. That's right in my home. So, I'm like, you got to be kidding me, man. You know, like, Filmo, man, I, that's, that's my... That's my uh, sibling, cause you know, from the East Bay, Oaktown. But you know, all, all the all the Bay is a uh, family to me. We all out here in the Bay. Same, we got the same style, dance moves, dress style, swag, composure. Man, we just got we just got the whole whole nine, the whole shebang. So yeah, whack one hundred man. Don't, don't be challenging JT the bigger figure. He put game on. He taught him the the business and all that man. You know, game. He's a uh, he's cuckoo for Coco Puff saying what he said that Kanye did more from him than Dr. Dre did. Kanye did more from him in two weeks than Dr. Dre did. But I mean that's false. But but yeah, man. What's up with whack one hundred? Always got something to say. <clears throat> he didn't even let JT the bigger figure talk. You know, it's like, let them, let them speak. Because, you know, when people don't let you talk, they know they can't beat you in, in your in your debate or your conversation or your discussion or whatever. That's what goes on in life, man. But, yeah. So, at the end of the day, JT, the big figure, is an independent giant. You know, that is big facts. Um, one, of the, one of the best to ever do it, man. Introduce some, a lot of acts in the Bay. Uh, you know, respect everything he did in Frisco. But whack 100, man. Can't be messing with my Bay Area peeps, man. Can't be doing that. <clears throat> so, yeah, man, what does everybody think about whack 100, man? Are you tired of him, man? He, he just always got to feel like he got to stick his nose in everybody's business, man. Everybody's business. You know, he, he, he's, he's a phony for real, man. He really is whack. <clears throat> you know, 40 Glock, he always be a uh, clown him all the time. It's like the funniest thing ever. You know, 40 Glock, he, he a trip. But JT, I got your back, man. You know, I know JT's has some, uh, you know, some things to say. And, you know, he felt that he won that conversation. I felt that he won that conversation, too. You know. He, he said what he said, man. Had game up in Frisco. Taught him the game, taught him the business. And game can rap. Game can definitely rap. But like 50 Cent said, man, he's not a great songwriter. He's a great rapper, but not a great songwriter. Uh, Like, if the beat's there, song's there, he can knock out a verse. And destroy it like yeah, games really with the lyrical. You know he he can definitely rap, but he was always you know jealous even of Lloyd Banks and, and G Unit because you know Lloyd Banks was the best in G Unit. You know Game got jealous of that. But anyway, yeah, whack one hundred man.
cool, cool your jets, man. Don't, don't be challenging JT. He's an independent giant, man. He's like what E forty is, but but like a he's like a, a like that, but non rapping wise. You know, even though he had you know game recognized game and all that, but but yeah, like but that wise, man. Like independent giants out here in the bay, man. We got it out the mud. Like the other independent giant, CML Lavish D always says, got it out the mud. No help. No promo. You know, no promotion, none of that. No, no label help. Got it out the mud. JT got it out the mud, so. Salute JT. You know, it's all to the great man. It's all to the great. You've done a lot for the bay. <clears throat> I've been listening to anything Frisco. You know, I like like every, every every rapper out here pretty much in the Bay. Like everybody can spit pretty much. Old timers, you know. Of course, everybody love E Forty Two Short. That's what that's what JT is. He's on he's on that level. You know, he, he's he's high up there like that. You know, Traplix TV. Once again, I salute y'all. And yeah. So you hit the like and subscribe button, hit the notification bell. What you guys think about the JT, the bigger figure verse, whack 100? Is whack being whack again? I just want to know. I think he is. That's just my opinion. But yeah, so, hey, pop your collar as we do in the Bay. Game recognized game in the Bay, man. Game recognized game in the Bay, man. Game recognized game in the bay, man. Baby, bay, man. Baby, baby, bay, man.